Why did your mother preach, eat more fruits and vegetables? Because these foods are packed full of important nutrients, especially antioxidants, those anti-sticky stuff nutrients that are so important for good health. While it doesn't sound very sexy, aging is like rusting. Let me explain what I mean. Our bodies are oxygen-burning machines. Every minute, countless biochemical reactions throughout the body generate thousands of particles of exhaust these are called oxidants, or free radicals. Trillions of times a day, free radicals hit our tissues like a steady rainfall, rusting away our cells. The rusting caused by these free radicals, or oxidants, not only contribute to chronic diseases such as cancer, but are also responsible for conditions associated with aging, such as hardened arteries, stiff joints, blurry vision, and wrinkled skin. Normally, our bodies handle free radicals by producing anti-rust chemicals called antioxidants. But when the body builds up more oxidants than antioxidants, the rust accumulates and increases the wear and tear on the tissues. Unfortunately, as we age, our bodies tend to produce fewer antioxidants. So as we get older, we need to eat foods that are rich in antioxidants. That means eating even more fruits and vegetables, and a wide variety of them, since different colored fruits and vegetables contain different types of antioxidants and other important nutrients. You will hear from scientists that aging is caused by a bunch of medical sounding words like oxidation, which simply means rust, inflammation, which boils down to wear and tear, and glycation, the stiff and sticky stuff that accumulates in your tissues. These three what I call shuns contribute to many conditions associated with prime time including hardening of the arteries and the itises, such as arthritis, bronchitis, dermatitis, and the one I call cognitivitis, which is more commonly known as Alzheimer's. To help you better understand this biological rusting, or oxidation, picture a fresh, crisp apple. Inside that apple, there are both oxidants and antioxidants. Over time, the oxidants outnumber the antioxidants. The apple gets softer, browner and more wrinkled. The apple ages. If you cut a fresh apple in half and pour lemon juice, an antioxidant, on one half, within a few hours the lemon juice protected half still looks good, or shall we say, younger. In contrast, the unprotected half looks brown and definitely older. It oxidized or rusted. Since our bodies are engaged in a constant rust versus anti-rust battle, I'm going to show you how to reduce your rust. One of the shuns I just mentioned is glycation, which again simply refers to the stiff and sticky stuff that accumulates in your tissues. When you eat like a typical teenager, which too many prime timers do, excess sugar molecules in your blood attach themselves to proteins and change their structure making them stiff and sticky. These aging proteins are actually called AGES, an abbreviation that stands for accelerated glycation end products. These stiff and sticky proteins act like sludge in the tissues of the body. One example of AGES is wrinkles, which appear when excess sugar attaches to the collagen in your skin. These ages act like stiff, rusted springs that pull down on the skin from the inside, causing wrinkles, as opposed to smooth skin. Another example of ages is hardening of the arteries, which occurs when ages stick to the lining of your arteries, making them stiffer. To reduce the stiff and sticky stuff throughout your main organs, such as your heart, brain, eyes, gut, skin, and joints, eat lots of these anti-rust antioxidants in your diet from fruits and vegetables every day. 